What's up, everybody? It's Mo from the Confetti Collective. If you've got a tween or teen in your home, I want you to make sure that you are prepared to deal with acne. Well, I don't want to use harsh prescriptions medications on my daughter's skin, so keep watching to find out what mask I created to promote clear, healthy skin in my daughter and in me. Now, I'm going to show you my matcha turmeric mask and first I'm going to start with matcha which is a green tea powder it's a powerful antioxidant that helps fight the sebum and the bacteria that can cause acne in your skin when it's applied topically next I'm going to add turmeric which destroys the bacteria that causes inflammation and it removes excess oil from the skin it's also antioxidant and anti-inflammatory which are both beneficial for acne honey has anti-inflammatory properties as well, and it helps prevent swelling and redness that can come from acne. And if you deal with dry skin, it's a natural humectant, and it can reduce some of the dryness and peeling that comes with other treatments. Next, you'll need some water, something to stir your ingredients with, and a brush. I mix everything together so that it's in a paste-like consistency. I actually added a little, more, little bit more of the matcha to this to make it a little bit thicker, and I'm going to use my, my Dollar Tree facial brush and I'm going to apply this mask all over my daughter's freshly washed skin. She uses a Cetaphil on her skin. That is all she uses. She washed and dried and I'm just applying this all over her face using the brush. You can apply this mask with your fingers, but it's a little bit more sanitary if you're using the brush and especially if you make enough to use for more than one mask more than one person then the brush makes it a little bit easier since you're going to be dipping the brush into the mask and on the skin you don't want to transfer bacteria back and forth so this is going all over her skin and it takes about 20 minutes to dry so she's keeping herself occupied while it dries since we had some of the mask left over i applied it to my skin as well and yes, I washed my face, but I did not take off my lipstick because whatever. So I'm just applying it in the same way that I applied it to her. I am using a different brush because I want to make sure that we are being as sanitary and has, as hygienic as possible. And I'm actually working from the opposite side of the bowl than I used for my daughter's face. So a same thing, applying the mask and we're gonna let it dry. We're gonna hang out together while it dries and we're going to rinse this mask off as with warm water. You could do this in the shower. You could do this over your sink. Just know that if you're doing it over the sink, it can get a little bit messy. You might have matcha powder all over your bathroom, but it's all good. Once you've rinsed this mask off, you can follow up with a moisturizer if this is daytime. If this is nighttime, you can follow up with your serum um, or your evening moisturizer. And there you have it, you guys. So check out this mask. Easy ingredients. You probably have them in your cupboard. And you will create clean, healthy, clear skin for your entire family.